So can you just re-emphasize the importance of the step of batching mm -hmm. versus organization? And then, of course, we want to hear your questions if you have them about this essential step. Absolutely. So yeah. again, I said this in the very beginning, we have not evolved biologically as fast as we have technologically. We simply cannot keep up with everything that's going on. And to do that, not only do we have to filter out the noise, but we have to be able to give ourselves that tunnel vision to effectively work on one thing, get it done, and move to the next. And as I said, multitasking really is rapid switching between tasks. So if you can just extend that a little bit and work on a task and then switch, and work on another task and then switch, that's how we actually start to get things done and feel like we're accomplishing the things that we really do want to accomplish. So with batching, you're looking at those things in your life that may be a little sporadic, that may take just a few minutes of time here and there, and putting them together at a time that we can get them all done together. So we've already talked about the work week and pushing together your meetings or corralling that stuff. This applies to email. I sort of alluded to this the other day that there are 10 minutes at the end of the hour, that's when you're going to deal with email. For example, a lot of people do do that if they say that, you know, why deal with the one email that comes in at the fourth minute of the hour and the two emails that come in at the 17th minute, 17th minute when I can just spend the last 10 minutes of the hour dealing with all those couple emails that have come in on those off hours when I'm not getting the bulk of my email. So you can do this also for working out, which we're going to talk about in wellness. You don't necessarily need to work out every day. You can sort of bunch that together into a much more effective, faster session in some ways. But meal planning is something that I think everybody can benefit from if they try this. Take a Sunday. Hopefully Sunday is a day off for everybody. Take that Sunday and spend a couple hours actually planning out a meal for the whole week. Or even if you don't make it, plan the meals that you're going to make during the week so that you don't have to scramble for it every time. Take that time to figure it out and benefit from greasing that groove and getting into some sort of momentum.